One more gang. Mr. Worldwide. Where's the kids? History in the making. I'm RJ Word. I'm from Los Angeles. And, uh, you know, I worked on the single Echa Paca with. Uh, there we go. Quieres que te lleve conmigo a la playa. Pide lo que quieras, pero no te vaya. I used to define it, I mean, not me, but the people gave me and. An the sticker. people who put you in boxes? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so they, they put me my sticker, and it was Electro Latino, because I make, in the beginning, I was making electronic music and mix it with Latino. So they call it Electro Latino, and now for me it's okay. And I take it as my flag. I try to find mixtures of sounds, whatever in the world, and I try to make it danceable. If danceable is a word, it's danceable. I mean, Echa Paca means come here, <laughs> but it's the way we say, I mean, I live in the Caribbean, I'm Spanish and Dominican, and that's how we say, Echa paca, but just for, for good things, for good vibes. Yeah, it, it's like, I mean, I don't, I don't speak Spanish, but um, it's, you know, I, I definitely, when, when singing it, was going for the come here, like on the beach vibes. You know, it's like, yeah. it's, I'm just singing the song to this girl on the beach, like, come here. I'm a mover, shaker, go get her, hustler, don't stop, get it, get it, baby. That's what we were looking for to have all those ingredients all over the world with people doing his thing. He's a that Latin Anglo world. He lives beside. The, the, the yeah. blend. Yeah. He is the crossover. We were trying to do that, to, to find that connection between many worlds, not just English and Spanish, but Brazilian because of the, of the funk rhythm. In fact, it's, that's my mission. I want to find that kind of fusions that make me feel motivated. We were working with some of the same like industry people, and I knew he was doing a show in Vegas, so I flew out there to see Vegas. that, and you know, hit it off, and knew we wanted to work on something. You know, nowadays with the social media, you think you know someone and personally because you see him every day. Mm -hmm. I always feel like it's a mission to make people dance. It's so rewarding to do live as well. Like when you're when you're putting a, a record together and you're just like, oh, you know that like at this moment in a song you can make, you know, 10,000 people go crazy right now. Mm -hmm. They'll just, everyone is gonna start jumping. There's like, and then bringing that to actually happening in the real world is it's like energy. It's so cool. Fusion is more prominent than ever right now. Just kind of everyone hearing each other's music. But what attracted me to Latin music in the first place was I went down to Mexico and uh, just kind of touring and, and showing my music uh, down there. And you spend about 80% of your time in the car and I was hearing stuff on the radio there all the time. And it definitely, it starts to, to get into you and you start kind of feeling feeling those vibes in, in a song. And uh, I think when you sit down to write your own stuff, it, it's gonna be influenced by whatever's around you, you know? And uh, you know, I, I'm always all for uh, experimenting and incorporating as, as many new good things as possible. RJ, Pepo, Richie K, Juan Magan. <laughs>